everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel for today's video i'm going to be talking about something that was requested to me a couple times in my dm and that question is what to buy and bring to college when you are a freshman or just when you're living in the dorms i am currently going to be a senior at the university of tampa so there will be some things in this video that are going to be tampa specific however if you are just a college freshman in general looking for some things to buy this stuff really applies to just about anyone so you can still watch this video even if you're not going to University of Tampa. The first thing that I want to talk about is one of the things that a lot of students run into is lack of storage space and a lot of the times your room is just really small your closet can't fit everything so basically you need things that'll take up less space but provide storage. So that is why I recommend getting an ottoman. If you've never heard the term ottoman before it's basically just like this cube that you can open up so you can put shoes inside, clothes inside. I know I use it for shoes one year, I use it for bathing suits this year. So basically it's for storage, but also because dorm beds are always so high. As someone who is only 5'1", I also used it as a step stool. So it was versatile given that it was functional for me to use as a step stool and also functional in the way that it was storage. On the topic of saving space, I also really, really recommend getting a shoe rack. This is something that I never would have guessed that I would need because usually I just put shoes in the bottom shelf of my closet. But having Having a shoe rack literally changed my life in school because not only can you put it in your closet and then there's racks and racks of shoes that you can fit on there, but you can also put it under your bed. The one that I got was from Walmart, I believe. It was so easy to build and it's adjustable so you can make it smaller and bigger. It was very convenient and really, really helped in terms of saving space in my room or using the most of the space that I do have. Something that you are definitely, definitely going to want to buy when you are living in in college dorms is an area rug. This is because the floors inside dorms are, they're, they're just, they're not comfortable, they're cold and they're dirty too. So you're gonna wanna get a rug. It probably will get ruined by the end of the semester so you don't wanna spend an arm and a leg on it because I know there's some really expensive rugs out there, but definitely invest in a rug. Something that I didn't really expect to need when I lived on campus, but really ended up needing is a garbage can. And when I say garbage can, I mean literally like a tall garbage can and garbage bags. When you are living on campus, you go through garbage like that. You are 100% going to need a garbage can, especially if your room is the hangout area and has a common area and people are in and out a lot, you're going to need a garbage can. Another thing that you probably won't think of off the top of your head that you definitely are going to need is either a hanging shower rack that you can put over the shower head and then put your shampoo bottles in, or I got a shower rack from Walmart that goes on the floor and that was really convenient too. So make sure you get a shower rack. Get one that has a few layers because if you're sharing the shower with you and your roommate then you're gonna want to have space for all of you to put your shampoo and conditioner and if you're going to a school that has community bathrooms get a shower caddy because you're not gonna want to leave your stuff in those showers on the topic of bathroom supplies and things, you're gonna wanna get a nice little bottle of poopery and that's pretty self-explanatory. I don't think I have to get into that, but you're definitely gonna want poopery. Okay, this next thing is pretty specific to the University of Tampa. However, many other schools are in the same boat. That is an umbrella and rain boots and a windbreaker. You're gonna want this if you're going to the University of Tampa or just anywhere that it rains a lot because in Tampa, Tampa from the month of August to like mid or the end of September, it literally torrential downpours every day at around 3 p.m. And not too long, it won't be the whole day, but it'll just come out of nowhere and it comes down hard. Like I'm talking torrential downpour. So you're definitely gonna want an umbrella because you're still gonna have to go to class. Another thing that you are gonna wanna make sure you definitely, definitely bring to college, no matter what school you're going to, is a pair of shoes that you do not care about. Like do not care about at all because they will get trashed at frat parties. What we call frat shoes and for me this was just an old pair of Converse that were like ripped and broken and I didn't care about anymore. Your old pair of shoes that you're planning on throwing out, don't throw them out. Take them to school and those are gonna be your frat shoes. Something that I completely forgot to bring and it ended up costing me so much money was dresses. Especially if you were in Greek life but even if you're in other organizations there's gonna be a couple of formals, semi 
formal. I forgot a dress, so I ended up having to go out and buy dresses and it ended up adding up because every semester I would forget to bring a dress and every semester I'd have to buy one. So make sure you have like two solid dresses and then you'll be good to go. On the topic of random clothes that you're going to need in college other than frat shoes, if you have a bunch of random Halloween accessories laying around from all your Halloween past costumes, like devil horns, angel halo, wings, literally anything of the sort, stuff them in a bag and bring all of your Halloween accessories. The amount of themed frat parties that you're probably going to be attending, you're gonna need them. You're going to want so many command strips because they're gonna come in handy throughout the year. You're probably gonna build up some more things that you're gonna wanna put up, especially if you're in a sorority. You're probably gonna get a bunch of canvases and decorations. So make sure you get a ton of command strips. I recommend the Velcro ones. They tend to just be easier to take on and off. The next thing that you are most definitely going to want to get is extension cords. In most, if not all dorms, the placement of the outlets are in really inconvenient places or dorm beds are freakishly high. And even when you can lower them, still your normal iPhone charger isn't gonna make it that high to your bed. So make sure you get an extension cord because you're gonna need it. You will thank me later. Off the top of my head, a few little extra trinkets that you're gonna want as a college freshman or sophomore or junior if you're living on campus is a lamp, makeup mirror, preferably ones that have lights because the lighting in dorms are absolutely horrendous, memory foam for your dorm bed, throw pillow, toothbrush cover, and or a toothbrush caddy. Mini fridge, recommend getting an air fryer. You can cook so many things that you would never expect to be able to cook in that tiny little air fryer. All right guys, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you found the information that I shared helpful. If you liked this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing. Thank you again for watching and I will see you guys next week. Bye.